Rhoda and Schwartz Minute Measurements. Hello there, my name is Rachel. Today I'm going to show you how to quickly generate a Wi-Fi 7 A.211BE signal using the SMW200A. You're going to start with the baseband, select standard A.211, toggle it on, choose the bandwidth 320 MHz, and then you can start frame blocks configuration. Start it, select the BE standards as Wi-Fi 7, you can double check is extremely high throughput with 320 MHz bandwidth. Now you can move on to PBDU configurations. Starting to increase the guard interval to 1.6 microsecond. And then user configurations, PBDU configurations. We're going to use MCS index number 10 for demonstration which categorize the Wi-Fi parameters such as modulation or coding scheme. In this case, 1024 QAM, channel coding, LDPC. You could certainly customize your data, like frame delay, scrambler. You could also double check your MAC header. If you want to make any changes, feel free to do so, but we're going to leave everything by default. Now you have your baseband, move on to RF carrier signal. We set the frequency to 2.4 gigahertz. Increase the power level to minus 5 dBm and turn RF on. Here you go. You have a Wi-Fi signal generated. One more trick to show you. We have the optimized EVM checkbox in the firmware SMW, which gives you better linearity of the CGen and a better EVM performance. Let's take a look at what the signal looks like. We are capturing total six frames within one milliseconds, and the standard showing me 8.11 BE Wi-Fi 7. Constellation showing me 1024 QAM as expected, and the EVM performance right now is minus 47 dBm. Thanks for watching. See you next time.